Hey everybody, it's Angie's Cooking Hour. Um, just thought I'd do a quick uh, cooking demo. I've already pre-chopped my, pot my potatoes. And then I also cut up my onions. They were from that to this. And I am now cooking this alfredo sauce for dairy free since I can't have lactose so I'm letting that simmer before I put the potatoes in there and then I'm making a little putting some bacon in there freshly chopped so we'll see how that turns out and if you haven't done so already like share subscribe and hit that notification bell and uh, because I can tell a lot of people aren't subscribing or that. It just depends on if you guys want notifications or not when I upload a video. So let's see how our food's doing. Yeah, I know. I need to do some dishes. Looking pretty good. Gonna be like a cream of potato soup for one person. And if I have leftovers, I'll just save them for later. So, what do you guys put a comment down below of what you uh, like to eat during this time of year? Cause my family this year is not putting up a tree at all. It's too much of a hassle. It truly is. Okay, let's see how this is doing. It's looking good. Just need to add a little pepper in it. You can add any type of flavor that you want to the uh, Alfredo sauce or if you just make from uh, your own. Okay, I don't want that to get too worked up here. Let me turn that on to simmer. Wait just a moment. I need to blow my nose. All right, we're going to go ahead and add the potatoes and the onions, the freshly chopped onions. So let's get these in there. I will see what I can do with one hand. <laughs> All right, here we go. Um, okay, this is not going to be pretty. Just one moment. All right, got the potatoes and the onions put in there. Now it's time to put the bacon bits in there. There's nothing better than fresh bacon bits. Or beef tips or chicken or... Okay, I can't touch that, so we'll see how this goes. Carefully put that in there. So I've been cooking. So my stove is a little dirty. I got pepper and tomato juice on there. Let's get some good stuff in there. Then once that's in there, then I'll turn the heat back up again. Can't go wrong with old corning ware. Holds up all these years. Put a little bit more in there. I love my onions, especially freshly chopped onions. Not meatless Wednesday, but it's small amounts, and you can always make a different batch if you choose to, especially those that don't eat much meat. I don't eat a lot of meat, but when I do, that's when I need a lot of protein. All right, now I gotta scoot this over to the back burner. There we go. All right. 
I'll turn this up and let it simmer. So once it's done, I will add some lactose free cheese and I will show you after I plate it. All right, there's my final result. It also has uh, lactose free sour cream in it. I'll show you the brand that I use. I put it back in the fridge. Oh, well. Okay, and my cheese that I put in there is plant based, non dairy cheddar shreds. And the sour cream I added is this brand. It's really good. My first time trying that, so if you decide to try some of this, then let me know. There we go. I had to garnish that. And uh, let me know in the comments below how you like yours, because I just put pepper, some sea salt, then the avocado. I'll put a I'll put a description down below. Um, thanks for coming to my channel. I appreciate it. And if I don't see you before the holidays, then happy holidays and have a happy new year. Thanks. I appreciate it. Bye.